Hello students. In this video series, we are going to teach you uh, 14 or 15 geometry facts. So let's get started. Okay, now the first geometry fact is pretty straightforward. If I have a right angle, such as this one, and it's divided into two or more angles, all the first geometry fact says is these angles must add up to 90 degrees. So let's have a look at how we might uh, do a question involving that. Look at this diagram up here in the corner. Here's my right angle. This angle's 35 degrees, and this one here, we're not sure what it is at this stage. Well, I'm going to solve this one using algebra, and then I'll show you another way of setting it out on the second question. So what I could say here is that angle plus that angle, or in other words, x plus 35, we don't write the units in algebra, adds to 90 degrees or equals 90 degrees. And then to solve that equation, we just undo adding 35, which is subtracting 35. And we get x equals 90 take 35, which is 55. And then we do put the units on. OK, and a quick check, 55 plus 35 adds to 90. So every geometry question uh, that we're doing in this unit can be solved using algebra. And when you get to some of the harder questions at the end, it's the, uh, the logical way to do it. But here's another way you can set out these easier questions. Here I've got an unknown angle x, and there's an angle of 12. We know that those two add together to give 90 degrees. So we could, in one step, just write x equals 90 take 12, and x equals um, 78 degrees. Quick check, 78 plus 12 is 90, so that's correct. Oh, but one thing I forgot to do is to actually explain how I know that. So every time you do a geometry question, you have to give the reason. So what I could do for this question here is I could write out the statement that angles in a right angle add to 90 degrees. What we do instead to save writing, because mathematicians don't like to write very much, is use the coded reason. And the coded reason for that is just the diagram. So we draw the right angle and we put the line through it. So for all of these questions, always include the reason. And the easiest way to do it is to use the coded reason. Okay, what I'd like you to do is stop the video now and have a go at the remaining two questions, please. Okay, let's get started. So I've, I've just moved the screen up so I have a bit of space to write. So I'm going to do this one using algebra, and I'll do this one using uh, just more arithmetic and common sense. Okay, so I know that these three angles add to 90 degrees, so I can write x plus 38 plus 28 equals 90. Okay, now what I have to do is, oops, what I have to do is simplify. So 38 plus 28, well, 30 plus 20 is 50, plus, six, oops, 50. Uh, go away line. It's not undoing. Okay, I'll try the eraser tool. Uh, well, there we go. Okay, 38 plus 28 is 50, plus 16 is 66. So I add those two together, and I know that that, equals 90 degrees, subtract 66 from both sides, and plus 66 minus 66 cancels out, and 90 takes 66 is, oops, not 34, 24. And that's 24 degrees. And as a quick check, you could say 66 plus 24. Well, 60 plus 20 is 86 plus 4 is 10. Okay, another way you could set the workout would just be to say that x equals 90 take away 23 take away 14. 
Well, 90 take away 23. If I take away 20, I get 70. Take away another 3, I get 67. And 67 take 14. Take away 10 is 57. Take away 4 is 53. So I think the answer is 53 degrees. Oh, by the way, let's not forget to put the coded reason on each of these. Like so. And we do a quick check on this one. 53 plus 14 is 67, 77, 87, 90. So that and that are both correct. Okay, so that's your first geometry fact. We have about another uh, 13 to go. See you in the next video.